Something strange happened when Uncle got married in Zambia. Jeremiah, who lived with Uncle, woke up on Saturday morning, thinking that he would enjoy a relaxing day and maybe play with some friends. But his new aunt stopped him before he could get out the door. Let's go to church, she said. Jeremiah thought she was joking. Who would want to sit inside church on such a lovely day? He had spent the whole week at work helping Uncle make cupboards and kitchen cabinets. Jeremiah was only 12, but he worked every day. He hadn't been in school since the third grade, and his father had been badly injured in a car accident, and he had to move in with his uncle. A few days earlier, Uncle had married a Seventh-day Adventist woman, and now she was inviting him to go to church. He didn't want to go, but he didn't want to be rude. No, I'll go later, he said. The next Sabbath morning, Aunt invited Jeremiah to go to church again. Let's go to church, she said. Jeremiah did not want to go, but he didn't want to be rude. Later, he said. The next Sabbath morning, Aunt invited Jeremiah a third time. Let's go to church, she said. Jeremiah did not want to go. But when he opened his mouth, he found himself saying something that he hadn't planned on to say. Let's go, he said. Aunt was so pleased. Jeremiah was surprised to find out that he was also pleased that he went. The whole Sabbath worship service was led by children. Children wearing green pants, white shirts, and yellow scarves marched into the church. Children wearing green pants... White shirts and yellow scarves sang at the front. Children wearing green pants, white shirts, and yellow scarves prayed. Children wearing green pants, white shirts, and yellow scarves preached the sermon. It was Pathfinder Day at the church, and Pathfinders led the Sabbath worship service. Jeremiah had never heard of a Pathfinder club and he wanted to join. He liked the Pathfinder uniform of green pants, a white shirt, and a yellow scarf. He especially liked that the Sabbath worship service, and he decided that very day that he wanted to give his heart to Jesus. The next Sabbath, Aunt didn't need to invite Jeremiah to church. He was ready to go to church before she could even say, Let's go to church. Let's go, he said to her eagerly. Soon he was baptized and joined the Seventh-day Adventist church. One day, a boy at church told him about the Rusangu Adventist school. Jeremiah wanted more than anything to study at the Adventist school, and he begged Uncle for permission to go. Uncle agreed. Today, Jeremiah is finished with 12th grade, and he couldn't be happier. But do you know who might be even happier? His aunt. My aunt is so proud that I am in the Adventist church, he said. When I'm at home, we always go to church together. On Sabbath morning, aunt rarely is able to say to Jeremiah, Let's go to church! Before she can open her mouth, Jeremiah says to her, Let's go. Thank you guys for watching. Give that little sub button a little bap for your boy. Also, hit the notification bell. Don't you dare forget about that like button either. And if you're feeling extra nice, you can go check out the Patreon. Link will be in the description.